Hello and welcome back to the Robot Studio Book Home for Toy Series. In this video I'm going to be making a bank. So, not a bank system, but you can rob the bank. So, okay, you make sure you have the bank, like the bank model inside. I'm going to add in a uh, string value and name it uh, bank value and set it, set the value to closed. And then and add in a script and just name it bank. I guess you just name it bank. Um, we'll be doing that in a sec. Um, make sure in the bank you have the money. This money, I'm going to add in a script to this now. So I'm going to add in the proximity prompt object money interact take. Add in a script and type this. And then obviously set the money to as ever much, you know, however much you want it to. And then however time, you know, I think just to test, we'll do 10 seconds. And then if you want to duplicate. And another thing you want inside the bank model is a teleport part, which is this is going to be where the players teleport outside the bank when it's closed, and the touchpad. Now this, it could just be in this room, but I think for the sake of, you know, people trying to glitch in and stuff, I'm going to put it all the way over, like, the whole thing. And so it, it usually just want to name that touch part, and this one teleport part. You can set this back at spawn, you can do it where, make sure it's above the ground. Now go to this touch part, and the script. Inside the script, you're going to write, want to write this, so the back value, touch part, teleport part of the variables and then so once the bank value is changed which is this bank value and just make sure you set that to closed and yeah so once the value is changed to open let's go to parent dot can collide equals false and so touch part dot can touch equals false so you can't encode it which is what we want for now and actually actually no, we can keep our script and then if the if it's closed then it will teleport the players to the teleport C frame and the game collide will be equal to true. Okay, so that's that script done as well. And now the last thing we're gonna to want to do is make sure you have a door. Make sure there's only one door, there can be two doors, and it's a bit you're just gonna to have to you know code the one door and then duplicate it. So inside the door add in a script and then you're gonna to wanna to write this to so the back value. And then once the bank value is changed to whatever it is, if it's open, then script of her dot can collide equals false, so people can walk through it. Else if bank value dot value equals closed, so then bank so script of her dot can collide equals true. So people can't walk through it. And then to finish it off, we're gonna to go to the bank script and type this. So bank script of parent, bank value, bank dot bank value, and then while to do, so like a little loop, bank value dot value equals open. And make sure you spell these right in the script, because that'll be a big thing that can cause you an error. And then 10 seconds, I'm just doing 10 seconds, you might want to do it a minute, 30 seconds, doesn't really matter. Okay, I think we'll test that out now. Okay, so I spawn him, I'm going to go to the bank, bank value, okay, so it's open right now, so I should be able to walk through, there we go. And going here, take the money, really quickly before it closes, take this money, oh and there we go, I get to the bottom outside. And it's closed so I cannot walk through here, I get teleported out, so I, if I can just about touch the part inside then it teleports me out, and there we go, it's open again, I can come in and I can take these, take the money, and there we go, before I'm teleported out again, and there we go. I think the thing, like it was a bit of a glitch there, you might want to raise it a bit so you don't get stuck on the ground. Apart from that, that is the video over. And obviously, it's not complete without the police system, so make sure you tune in for the next video because I'm going to be making a police system so you know police can stop the criminals. As well as, um, I've got a data saving script on my, on, on my channel, 
So there's no point getting the money if it's not going to save. And then also, also there's no point getting the money if there's nothing to spend on. So I've also got a house system video, a car system. You can make money legally or illegally. It's up to you. Um, but yeah, so make sure you tune into those next videos and I'll see you in the next one. See ya.